What's up guys and welcome back, we're here with another part of our Nervi campaign, playing with the Davide et Impera mod. And in uh, today's episode, the aim is to take out the Haru's Koz um, in Tullyferdom, I'm definitely butchered both those names, um, and kind of just like get ourselves a little uh, like little city in um, Germania, basically. Um, in the last episode, we did take out Trevorum and um, secured a bit of a... Uh, well, a post in Belgica, even though we are a Belgian tribe. So we are, like, slowly consolidating ourselves on the western side of the Rhine. It's now time to go east and uh, get some more lands here. We have a pretty strong army. We have a lot of, uh, well, two units of cav. It throws me off a bit that they're in different spots. but And we have just a lot of a lot of these club these club men, basically. basically, even though they're short swordsmen. So, well, yeah, we'll deal with them. We'll end the turn. And we'll see what happens. I'd just like to thank everyone for all the support in the last episode. Um, much appreciated. Always um, love the support. See likes, um, comments, and uh, subscribe if you're new around here, obviously, and you're avid, an avid watcher of the channel and you haven't subscribed, then please do go and subscribe. Um, always helps out with the channel. Um, but yes, uh, there are people that are wanting a Saxon campaign. I've just mentioned it now because the clay didn't get to the end of the last episode um, to see it. But it will be coming out uh, pretty soon. It's probably going to be at the beginning of next week. Um, if you're watching this, obviously, like, the day it comes out. Um, that'll probably be, like, mon uh, Monday, out on Monday. And, um, yes, so for those of those who will be wanting to watch that, that will be out with uh, the Radius mod, probably, just to kind of increase the roster again. So it's not just an entirely uh, vanilla campaign. It will have a bit of a bit of a change to it so we'll go we'll keep marching up this way it looks like oh we definitely can't reach okay they do have a large army of 20 stack of their own um this is also made up of rubbish in here so i'm going to probably just lure them out and try and do some stuff i'm going to attack them uh, to try and get the spy upgraded i guess and we'll see whether we can do anything sabotage the army a little nope he got wounded perfect that's just what we want just what we needed um, right, we're doing all that. That's brilliant. So one more turn and we can get ourselves a quarry. Let's see if there's anything we can do in the diplomacy. I imagine not because no one really likes us. Um, Non-aggression? No, I'm not too fussed about that then. As long as you've got a trade with them, most people seem to not really care about anything else. Let's just... Uh, no? Uh, you're at war with these guys. I don't know yet. Join Confederation. Sakani. Um, yeah, I don't think we're going to get anything with any of these people. The Ubi. Do I have trade with you? No, and I can't get trade with you. Oh, well. The chance to get anything with them is gone. Um, so we'll end the turn, I imagine. And we'll just see whether this uh, German faction attacks us. It would be nice if they did. Um, we've got enough cav now that um, I'm quite happy to kind of just send them out to do their own thing. And we'll get some, and it'll be good for the income if we can get some more stuff. Because it seems like it's actually quite a prosperous city. 1700 a turn. I don't know what these are on, but that's pretty good. I can't complain about that. Cannot complain. Let's see if we get through some of these factions. There's a lot of factions to get through. Look at all them. Look at all them. Here we go. Um, right. It says these. We've got a pretty good chance of winning this. They brought a lot of. They brought no cav. Excellent. They do have a lot of their own stuff. So we'll do this battle. Um, and we'll see... I will see you guys on the battlefield for a great fight with the Wolves of War. Hey guys, so we're back on the battlefield. And uh, the plan is basically use these Club Diori... Uh, or Club de whatever. The, the, the swordsman, the short swordsman, as main front line. Um, actually, no, we'll probably pull them back a little bit. Uh, let's pull them back ever so slightly. Let's put the skirmishes out front. As usual. Got to get that initial shot, first shot off. Then we'll have these berserkers as reserve. Followed by the general in reserve. And I'm going to put the spears out on the flanks to just support. I mean, there's no cav um, for the enemy, but just for the sake of it. And then I'll put all the cav on the right, I think. There we go. We'll just go with that and we'll see what happens, I guess. Um, we should probably win this. I think quality is just so much better. They also have some heavy melee infantry guys. So I'm probably I'm going to focus their guys down with um, 
well with slingers and then I'm probably just gonna mop up all of their um, light missile infantry as well with cav and we'll see what happens I mean they've got a lot of medium spears I don't know what these guys are like probably well probably average I mean I've got medium spears as well so we'll see how they do they've got a lot of medium stuff they've got a lot of phalanxes as well because apparently they're pikemen there's pikes for goddamn Germania that's brilliant um, just what we needed uh, you can start focusing these guys down then. Um, focus these guys down. Uh, can you keep moving? There you go. You start shooting more stuff. Uh, and then the cav can go wide. We have discovered the enemy's hidden can you just go away? I don't just need to know about you at all. Okay. Um, start shooting these guys. Start shooting these guys with your jabbies. Oh, they've got no infantry here. Well, just run these guys down. Um, right, so you can just get in. Looks like... Oh, you, oh you've used all your ammo as well. Brilliant. Um, you can just come forward. You can come around and you can come around. Perfect, perfect. Um, you go over here. You go in there. Go into the next one. Actually, no, go and shoot them. Um, and then you fill up the lines because you're fighting all the berserkers, so or like the berserker sort of tier units. Yeah, apparently they are called berserkers, so. Well, you just deal with them. Kill them all. Um, and you go in here. Go in here. Uh, can you just actually attack them? They're not, if they're not going to move, then you attack them. There they go. They move now, of course. I was just thinking, are these the phalanx guys? Where are the phalanxes? They're all the way back here. Right. All oh, my skirmishers focus down these guys. These pikemen. Goddamn pikemen. I'm not letting these guys get out of here okay, alive. Um, you charge in, please. Looks like these Club Dioria are actually doing absolute work today. Look at these guys. They're overwhelming them. Like, the quality must be just so good. Oh, uh, these spears are just getting picked off as well. That's not so good. Um, I'll let them just carry on doing their thing. They're clearly not doing enough damage to actually make it worthwhile attacking them. We'll go this way. We're going to have to run down a lot of these guys today. Um, because, well, they're outside the city. Um, you go for them. You go for them. So we'll mop up all the archers first. Um, and then, I don't even need to send the general in. I'm just going to give it a pop of a rally for the sake of it. Um, can you just march in and kill all these guys? That would be brilliant. Oh, yes. Get all of these medium spears. Get all these guys. Run them down. If they're going to just stay out here and just get murdered. Um, their pikes are now in, so I'm going to focus on their general with my slingers. That would be brilliant. Um, 80 of you left. Keep getting going. Oh, God. Oh, a bit of lag there. I'm not sure why that's the case. Oh, there we go. Alright, there we go. All sorted. Um, you. Run down. Uh, slingers aren't the end of the world. Um, actually, run down these slingers, please. Um, you surround these guys. Um, and then just go after this general. These Club Diori have got nothing else to do. I don't know how you pronounce it, but that's how it's being pronounced. They're getting a focus down though by archers. Jeez. And there we go. A huge break. Huge, massive break, actually. That is huge. That's brilliant. That's brilliant. Keep it up, Nervi. You're doing a great job. Doing a great job. Um, there you go. Then circle these okay. lot. Encircle and surround. Murder them all. Um, the Cav might as well just become like a mop up crew. Just run down anything that's uh, breaking away. Because, I mean, the infantry's doing a great job. I'm going to hold fire with the. Infantry, uh, well not the infantry with the slingers, they're doing a too good a job right now, uh, some might say. Um, these medium spears aren't actually that big a problem then, it's these, these ones are probably actually kind of the problem. But it looks like we're mopping up everything very nicely, and they're just going to have to be forced to the edge of the map, so that's fine. And they're happy just to carry on, yeah, they've there's, there's barely lost any anyone doing that. Um, yeah, it looks like my Javi's taking a lot of hits. I don't know whether they're actually worth holding on to then. Warriors. 
Yeah, just keep cutting these guys down. These phalanxmen doing their bit. Mow them down. Excellent. So this is a huge encirclement. That's brilliant. Uh, send the general in, I guess, for some kills. Get him some kills. Get him some XP. Um, send them in there. Send them that way. Yeah, where's my other cav? Oh, it's over here. Um, mop these guys up then. Like, look at these guys. There's 170 of them left there was. And they broke those medium melee. That's ridiculous. Run these guys down. There we go. That's them all gone. I don't know what's left. Um, possibly these guys. Oh, these guys are left, yeah. Uh, we're going to continue for a little bit. Um, just speed this up. Let's just mop all these guys up. Lovely. Run these guys down. Uh, I don't know how much of this we're going to catch. We'll catch some, but not all. Um, General, hold your fire. Just stop doing whatever you're doing. That's a fair amount. Um, I'm going to end it there. There we go. Just quit battle. Lovely. Decisive victory. There we go. The Nervi lost 500 men. We still have 4,000 men to assault these walls. Only really this unit here and this unit here kind of got beaten up. I mean, I'm definitely going to have to... I'm definitely contemplating getting rid of this javelin unit. They're pretty good. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, guys, I will see you back on the uh, campaign map in a moment. So we're back on the campaign map and we destroyed this army. I'm probably just going to execute. I don't like that. This little change capital thing just appears here. I'm probably now going to attack the army that's now outside to uh, take Tully Ferdum um, without assaulting the walls, basically. Or near enough. I don't know if we will destroy the entire army. But the army will get lured out and we can do just that. So that is the plan. So we'll make that the first, well, one of the first things we do. Uh, we might as well get... Oh, you kidding me? Did they get... They've got a disease. Disease has come to our lands. That's brilliant. Um, I'm going to put replenishment on. Just because now we're going to have to... We're going to need it. Um, and I guess this one. Um, which is going to get... Ferocious Warrior. It's going to give us more Gravitas. And 5% melee attack. For all swords. Very handy. Um, I have to put Earthworks in for growth. It seems like growth is going to be a key prob a key thing and a key, well, maybe a key problem as well. Um, why is this going down? Is this just, be that's going to increase, but it's not actually giving us any negatives, but it's also giving us slave for wealth. Neither would a trench mine actually do anything negative for us, but I'm kind of happy just leaving Trevorum how it is for now then. Um, I'm going to, I can't, oh yeah, I can attack this guy. Well, there we go. I'm going to order resolve this one. Um, 63. I don't know. I mean, these guys are pretty awful. Maybe I could get a better result. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to order resolve this one. Maybe not worth it. We'll see. It's worth worth the risk. Yeah, it was pretty atrocious, actually, with the amount of losses we took. Uh, we'll kill the captives, and then we'll... I guess I could just attack... The settlement, and yeah, there we go. 86. I'll take this with a lot more ease. There we go. The Haru Koz, or whatever their name is, is dead. And we lost no units. That is good. I'm just going to probably take it for myself. Um, we are still starving, I think. Oh, or were we. I don't know if we had a disease or whether. I don't think death, death was stalking us just quite yet. But, um,. Newly captured bonus uh, makes it dif different from other regions. This includes making these. I don't know what that's really done. But there we go. We've done some stuff. We've got our economy's really shut up looking at that. That's brilliant. Um, and yeah, I'm not really too worried about that. Res Reservoir's great. We'll keep that going. Current growth rate, five. Accumulated growth, zero. Well, we need some growth going on here so we can build some more stuff. Um. I'm going to try and get some diplomacy with some of these guys. These guys are at war with... Oh, God. How do you pronounce that? Nahan Navali? Maybe. I don't know. You are welcome. But they'll take trade, so that's good. Uh, moderate. And they want money. I'll give you money for non-aggression. For now. For now, you can have it. And then you love us. Yeah, they'll take trade. Non-aggression. Moderate. No. But that's fine. I'm, we've got trade. 
That's fine. That's a good start. Um, the Frisians probably might be our next target then because they seem to... Well, and, and maybe these guys. Uh, I don't know. Certainly if we make a good garrison here, like that's probably what I'm going to put in next, certainly, to try and just... So I don't need to worry about these guys. Moderate? No, I didn't think that. I didn't think they would. Let's see if we can offer them some money. There we go. A little bit of money. Put it aside. They'll love that. Love the bit of that, don't they? Um. Okay, boy, you can shut up now. You've you said your bit. Wherever you are down there. Okay, these guys are really strong, actually. Good to have them on our side, or uh, for a bit. Um. Yeah, minus 37, not so great, but that's probably going to be okay after... Well, we'll move the Garmy out next turn. I'm going to move it back to uh, Bagacum, and probably then from there, maybe... I don't know who I'll go after. We'll certainly go from there, because I think we can recruit some better stuff if we wanted to. Or we could certainly recruit another army. We have the money, too. Um, actually, no, we don't really have the food, though. Don't really have the food. The fields might be needed. But we'll end the turn, and we'll see... What happens? I could really do with more. F it seems like food's really a problem in this part of the world. Fertility is just goddamn awful. But it's Germany, so Germany at this point in the time, I guess. Just apparently, we have huts and we can't we can't farm to save our lives. Understandable. I can see why they think that. We just do go around uh, raiding and pillaging and just taking land for ourselves. But we've expanded it. We now have a walled city for ourselves. I don't... I think if I was going to move my... Oh, okay. Um... I really want to go to war with these guys at some point. I mean, I want to go to war with most of um, this part of Gaul, to be honest. I want to take most of Gaul as possible. Um, I'm going to say no for now. Uh, no... Well, we've got trade with both of those factions. If they're going to break trade with me, I know that that's a sign that they're going to try and try something. Whether they both try at the same time, um, a bit unfortunate if they do. But I mean, we have a good garrison in this place. It's fourteen, um, and I could certainly do some work with that on a wa on the walls if they try and assault. Uh, agent recovered, of course. That's good. Um, this is what's this going to do? Um, I'd rather bring down the costs. There we go. Scout is recovered. He is probably at Tilly Ferdum. There he is, yep. Yeah. Well, I'm going to bring this guy out and we're going to move him just out there. Is it just because of growth? Manpower or local events? Okay, just uh, I think events is the reason why this is so low. Yeah, events. Well, it's actually events is plus four. Um, I'm going to move the spy up here. We're going to probably go for these guys next. Yeah, look, these two have made an alliance now. That's not surprising. Um... So if we go to war with one, we're going to go to war with the other. Um, pretty similar army, a bit more elite. These guys are in here. They've got some more mostly Germanic spear band. They're pretty good. Um, but they've got no cav. It seems to be that if I have cav in my armies, they seem to be doing just fine. And they've got more pikes. That's not so good. Um, but yeah, these are, it's not really the end of the world. I kind of would like to go to war with them next. I'd also like to go to take out these guys. at Cenobum. Gonna be interesting how to I get through them though. I might have to ask for military uh, military access, whether which one will give it to me. Ah, they just gave it for free. There we go. Not a problem. Um, so I can go through. Uh, well, actually, it might be best to get it on both. No, apparently not. Apparently, you'd hate that. Um, yeah, go on. Then you come with the three hundred. I'd really like some of you to join my co uh, join a confederation. Oh well. Um, confederation maybe another time. Another time, perhaps. Um, the economy's looking great. Food, not so much. Um, would really like if my food would sort itself out. Uh, if we complete this one. Oh, we get plus three food. That would be pretty handy. Cattle ranch, salt kill, and clay pit. Hmm. Certainly might be an idea to go down that. Um, what else do we get? This is replenishment, replenishment, uh, replenishment. Oh, is this one just all food then? Oh, that's pretty handy. We might want to go down this one as much as possible. Um, oh, they start to cost after a bit. Oh. Not into that. Not into that at all. 
Okay, enemy siege out. Okay, then movement. Okay. Well, we'll end the turn. Hopefully, we don't take too much more damage from our food situation. We really can't afford to have any more uh, food problems. Not that we've had any yet. Just that it's looking very risky right now, and I'm not a big fan of uh, not a big fan of that at all. Would rather uh, we sort that out ASAP, basically, and uh, we can. Get on with our merry, um, on our merry way with the uh, conquering Gaul, and maybe Germania as well, if you have time. It's like an outpost over here. Very handy. That though the uh, income has already gone mass down massively. Look at that. That's disgusting. Though it looks like it will rebel at some point as well. So we might be having to hold off on the old expansion for a little bit, while we sort ourselves out internally. We'll see. Votive offerings. Ah, that's nice. And our food's gone up a little bit. We're back up to two. Oh, because of this place. Excellent. Well, I'm going to up it again, I think. Squalor. Uh, it's okay on Squalor front here. I mean, we're at zero and zero. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that. I really would just like to keep this place growing and just being better. Accumulated growth, 11. And we need uh, 30 for a surplus. Well, we get in there. We are getting there. And then this place. For a surplus, we only need another 14. That's Well, another 2. We're going to be there in no time. We'll be fine. Absolutely fine. Um, yeah, I don't know. Really, I'm probably just going to bring this guy over here. Because this is the people I would like to go to war with next, I think. The Frisians can do their own thing. they got their fish. They have their fish and they can do their things. Um... Let's see what's happening in the faction. Is anyone really hating me? We're protected for 11, uh, 10 more turns. Everyone seems to love us. That's fine. We can deal with that. We can deal with the love. Uh, oh, I'd like these guys. Manpower, a uh, pay guy. And we don't have many pay guys. Oh, they don't have pay guy really in this region. But in, maybe in this one. We'd have plenty in this region. Um, whether I'm going to raise another army just yet. I don't see the need. I mean, everyone else is doing it, but it's not really like that much of a big deal. Like, I mean, I presume these guys are at war with someone, and they've lost an army. Yeah, they're at war with the Helvetii, which you're guessing here. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm not so fussed about them. They're in a the guys here are in a rough situation, possibly if if it goes all wrong. I mean, they've not even got full stacks yet. They could be attacked from both sides, from these guys here and those guys. But anyway, we'll end the turn instead of looking at everyone else's politics. And we'll see what happens. I just want to get this army across the map. I probably actually could have done it then, couldn't I? I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. I could have probably moved it. I just want to keep replenishing. Get through as many turns as tech as well, so we can get on with um, getting the better stuff. Just getting more food, especially. More food would be very key. Because I think armies cost food in this game? I'm not really sure. I am really need to have a look because otherwise I can't have many armies because I ain't got a lot of food. In this part of the world is not fertile. <laughs> it is not fertile. No, no, no. You can have it for nothing. No, no, no. You can have it for nothing. There you go. Let's keep it going down. Yeah, 420 is, there. 420 is their lowest offer they will give me. All these Gallic tribes that we've got to destroy. It's going to be a sad day when we have to kill them all. And unite Gaul under one banner. A feast as well. I can I can get behind that. And there we go. It's very unhappy. Or it's unhappy. But it's sorting itself out already. Look at that. I mean, it's down to events. But I mean, the food situation is also not brilliant. It is not brilliant. A tributary. Ooh. Or a warlord's great hall allows us to get a lot of cool stuff. Oh, okay. Actually, this allows us to get a lot of cool stuff anyway. But it does actually... And then this is a hilltop... Uh, a podium. A podium? Okay. Well, 
I'm gonna just go across. Okay, you're actually replenishing here now as well. That's brilliant. Um, let's just keep going across here. Because I'm gonna bring the army back just for temporarily. Um, if this place starts to rebel, then it starts to rebel. Do we have... Oh, how many more turns? Okay, so I don't know how much... Oh, we have growth factor... Uh, I don't know. Current growth rate, 2. So we need a lot more. Now, while this place is on current growth rate, 3. Okay, so we're nearly at that one. My bad. I was get, getting far too excited thinking we, we're going to be growing no time, but it's not the case. Um, oh, Germanic's going up and Celtic's going down. Not good. Is this Sontio? I don't know. Well, I probably will be putting in a... Um, like something for religion here. I don't know what. Can I look at other stuff? No. Um, let's look at tech because that's the easiest way to do it. Um, I'd like. Well, I say that easiest way to do it. It's not really. Um, I will end the turn and we'll just see what happens. There's not much we can do. Oh yeah, I forgot to move my spy, but he's he's gonna move for me. We'll go and have a look and see what's happening in. Uh, Cenobum or whatever it's called. I really need to expand a little bit more. Certainly take... Ah, I see that army. Maybe it's time to send the army back. <laughs> the way it came. That's not happening. That is not allowed to happen. So we'll... Um, totally further may need that garrison replenished and this army sent back. So we'll certainly do that. Um, try and counter their march. Certainly they'll go for one or the other of these places. Surprised to go for this one first. But I'm not complaining. They can go for either. They will get the same result. It will be death. Death and destruction. And it looks like... Oh yeah, these guys are doing their bit. They are actually got a very wealthy pro uh, province here. Surprised no one else is... I mean, no one's got like a third building yet. Which I would really like. It's... Kind of hard to grow, and certainly in this part of the world. Okay, there they go. Earthworks, okay. I guess. What are you doing here? Uh, could I just garrison here? I could fortify, certainly. Oh, local region. Non barbarian armies use food from global supply. Local region. Oh, okay. I'm going to go into here because I want to stop these guys from coming across. I don't think we could beat them. It would be close. I don't think we could. Not very confident in my uh, army for doing that. Um, I'm going to go for craft specialists. So we get lots more um, money from income and from trade. And we also get local tradesmen, clay pit, public market. Very useful, all of them. Uh, you're doing absolutely nothing that I can care to believe in. And you're, yeah, you're still doing your bit. Um, I don't know. We could go to war with these chaps. They're in a defensive alliance. They're still at war with these guys. They're at war with someone like here. Oh, I don't know. I could. Uh, I'm just might wait until they make the move. They might make the move in a minute. I don't know how far they can reach. Actually, they can't get across this river. What idiots. Okay, well, that's interesting. Well, we'll end the turn. We'll see what happens. I'm getting through quite a lot of turns at the moment, but... Oh, yeah, I forgot about the spy. He's irrelevant anyway. We don't need him. He just looks at things and goes, Oh, yes, that looks pretty nice. That looks pretty nice. I would, uh... I'd attack that if I was you. But yes, these Frisians look like they're uh, certainly getting ready for a fight, and we can't have that. The Bell game must show their strength. Whether that's... Well, it's going to be strength of arms. We have no... Our economy is not great. Oh, okay. They do, as expected, everyone's got full stacks, maybe a bit more at this point. I also could afford a second stack, but... I don't know if I want to. And I think, so putting my army in the local province probably, here we go, they want military access, yeah that's fine actually, that works for me and you. 
I don't know who you're at war with, but I need it to get through your lines to attack the other people. Oh, and they've sent their army out. I'm allied with them, though. I'm definitely not damaging my relationship with the, these guys just yet. That can come at a later date. They, I think, are at war with these guys here. Which may also be a good choice to go to war with. Actually, though, I think I've got trade with them as well. Disease? Uh, for, oh, these guys up here. Yeah, well, no one cares about them. They're just going to stand there. Well, you do you. Palmyra has, rise, has risen up from the, from the ashes. Um, you are at war with the Iceni as well. Okay. Did not see that coming. And you're at war with these guys, which I know about. Um, hmm. Interesting. I might raise a second army then. While we wait. Any of these any good? Council of Chieftains, Morani Chieftains, Remy Chieftains, Council of Chieftains, Council of Chieftains. I've forgotten what faction I am. None of them. I'm the Nervi Chieftains, of course. I should remember this. Seeker Spouse, by the way. Please. I would like you to have children at some point. Uh, I don't know. Um, per turn for ruling political party. Yeah, do that then. Uh, I'm not so care. Don't really care about that. I don't think you can lead armies, can you, love? No. Didn't think so. I'm gonna put in. Uh, this guy was pretty. Looks pretty good. I think he's got a lot of. Uh, <laughs> certainly a lot of stuff going on. Right. So we're just gonna put him in. I'm gonna give him an uh, army. Yeah. There you go. So he's. Oh yeah. So there you go. Taking him into. Um, taking him out of the fortress basically hurts the food but inside he's fine I'm gonna put a lot of these guys in these are axemen apparently um, they oh yeah I think they are but they look pretty damn good so I'm gonna keep them accumulated growth uh, or current gray uh, yeah Ugh. so we're gonna get a growth thing in here soon I'm gonna probably sort out my well it says it's not changing too much now I'll just leave it how it is I may put in something with economy um, or happiness I'm not really sure foods always obviously uh, on the back of my mind as well needs to be sorted out and certainly if this army I guess goes into garrison somewhere it probably will be fine whether it goes into garrison here or in um, Bagacum one or the other that should be fine but I mean right now I'm gonna just fortify here oh god fortify and then just wait for this guy to come and attack basically what's he gonna do I would like to see um, can we recruit more? Oh, we could recruit more of these guys. And we could recruit more of these very, very good cav. But, I don't know. We might hold off on them. I am going to need some cav in this army. But I'll just see what, how it go. I, also, these guys are pretty damn good. And slingers have been pretty f effective for me so far. I don't know what these Belgian hunters are like. Maybe okay. Who knows? But, um... That is probably where I'm going to wrap up today's episode, guys. If you enjoyed them, please do leave a like and subscribe. Um, really helps out the channel and for those of you that are waiting on the Saxon campaign it is coming out soon uh, It will be probably out uh, early next week um, But if you want to like I said if you want to see more Divi et Impera and more of the Nervi campaign, please do leave a like um, Subscribe and comment and go and check out the papal discord um, To join some battles and get involved um, with the well the doing the, the going on of the channel I guess if you want to send in some replays to go on the channel Send them in. Um, I always need more. So, until next time, Legionnaires.